it has been my biggest dream to have a very big farm to help my, my country, food security, and help my community, my siblings, and my family members. But my production is not enough to give me enough cash. And due to the low input I'm having, I can't produce more. Nigeria has an estimated population of about 174 million people. 70% of the workforce are involved in agriculture. The challenges farmers face are having access to information on government programs and market opportunities. FMARD is the Federal Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development. So the business of this ministry is to design policy and implement and coordinate between the various seg segments of government. We have no farms of our own, so all we do is to guide and to lead. Very often you require information on what is even happening within the agricultural space in the country. And the importance of knowledge sharing was practically lacking. We had information, but they were not documented. People were doing things on their own. People could not build. So you discover that efforts were being wasted. Of course, there have been a lot of programs here and there, but they were not institutional memory. The World Bank was invited to now build the capacity of the staff, of the officers, in Nori capturing, in particular, sharing, documentation, and uploading. The end result is reaching out to farmers, but before that, you have to build in-house capacity. That is what this specific program has been doing. They have been able to build the capacity of the ministry by using different type of tools. Video, voice recording, writing success stories. Every opportunity we have now to capture something that is new, that could be shared with others to enhance their productivity, we make sure we capture it. FMAD has seen the value of knowledge sharing. And right from the minister down to the lowest officer, there is increasing consciousness of knowledge sharing. After being trained, my capacity was strengthened more. So I volunteered. Now I'm a knowledge sharing facilitator. You're trying to actually get the real stakeholders, the farmers, you share knowledge with them so that they can actually go back to their communities, their respective cooperatives, you know, and actually replicate or put into practice what we've taught them so they can also become knowledge champions in their own right. I was so excited about the knowledge sharing because I will contribute to the other farmers. And when they share their own knowledge with me, they will also contribute to my life and I will become better off. The last one year, I think, our capacity to reach people has really begun to impact in a very outstanding manner on the output of agriculture. And we can see great leaps in the very near future. Things are already changing. Information are getting to the right stakeholders. And very soon, the impact will be felt all in the pocket of the farmers. And that is the exciting part of it. We need to actually take knowledge sharing down to states, local government areas, communities. It should be a nationwide program. If we can solve the problem of low productivity, Farmers' income will be enhanced, and that is our target. I want to increase in farming. I want to increase from one hectare to 10 to 20 hectares. I want to grow because I want to make good money to do more work for my community. I want to feed the nation. 